Welcome to the Tao Shi'ar training facility. Were you expecting the training facility to be a tangible object? You should realize that the most valuable learning you will ever do takes place not in a classroom or a gymnasium or a firing range, but out on the frontier, where there are no instructors to evaluate your performance but the laws of nature. Besides, this way the Tal Shiar saves the expense of having to build, staff, and maintain an actual training academy. We are impressed with your service thus far. You will be much more useful to the Star Empire as a member of the Tal Shiar than an ordinary fleet officer. Very few are chosen. Fewer still survive the training. Though we may do as we wish and could simply press you into our service, tradition dictates that we present you with the opportunity to decline. With the understanding that this is a lifelong undertaking, are you willing to enter the Tal Shi'ar? Very well. From this moment forth, you are an operative of the Tal Shi'ar. Your vessel and crew are still technically part of the regular fleet, but from this time forward, your orders will come from us. I mentioned that we do our training in the field, in real situations. We believe that it is most effective to learn by doing, and as there is no dearth of crises facing our empire, there is also no lack of training lessons. Today, you will learn to put down a rebellion whose members have stolen one of our warships and are defecting to Federation space. It goes without saying that the Federation would learn a great deal about our technology if they were to receive one of our ships to study at length. You must destroy or capture that ship and crush the rebellion. In true Tal Shi'ar fashion, you will have to think quickly, using only the resources at hand, including your ship, your crew, and your wits. Maintaining the iron rule of the Star Empire is our ultimate duty. There is no failure in the Tal Shi'ar, only victory or death. return to our planet, but first we must retrieve an antidote to the Gyurn virus that has reached epidemic proportions on our world. Wait! What if just a skeleton crew remained and you took the rest of us out of custody? Certainly you will trust us to return for our friends and family. Wait! Wait! I know you are a ship captain in the Empire. But surely you are a Romulan first and foremost. The virus was released by a Tal Shi'ar weapons research facility here on the planet. The safety precautions were not enough.
done. We are often called upon to make hard choices in the Tal Shiar, decisions which can affect billions. Through our efforts, we keep the Star Empire strong by asserting its dominance over any other concerns. You have correctly surmised that giving in to the demands of the weak, or even entertaining their point of view, can lead to fatal indecision and the spread of chaos. Let the Praetor or the Senate deal with the issues of the populace. If they fail to resolve a problem, we step in to eliminate it. Your command ability has never been in question, but I needed to see for myself if you truly had what it takes to be one of us. Welcome to the Tal Shi'ar. We'll get to that after I impart some new information. Now that you are one of us, I can reveal more about what happened to the Unity Starbase. Correct. The initial attack by the Rakeli was motivated by Tal Shi'ar operatives. However, we gravely overestimated the Rakeli military's capabilities. They barely had the firepower to scratch the station's armor. You're as smart as I'd hoped. The Rakeli affair was a dangerous miscalculation on our part. However, multiple Klingon task forces soon descended upon Rakeli territory to investigate and launch reprisals. As we already had a large number of operatives in the area, we were able to use this incursion to our advantage. We lured a Klingon vessel away from its battle group and captured it. We then inserted our operatives, who assumed the identities of the vessel's key personnel. They were instructed to build some...